Welcome everybody, it's Firehawk D, and today we're playing a pretty old game actually, Assault Heroes. I've actually owned this game since almost since I got my 360, back in 2009, and finally got around to doing it. I actually uh, have completed it completely, so it was really short. It took me a few hours, so I was like, ah, I'll pick a random level and just do it on video. And it's this video, this one right here that you're watching. So we're going to go through it. The problem is, of course, I'm starting at a later level, and usually by now I'd have maxed out weapons, I wouldn't have died at all, because you can play the whole game on easy for all the achievements. And what fool wouldn't do that? So now I've got to kind of just manage through, I guess, with my weak weapons. We'll see how this goes. I'll take that. Oh, Flamethrower is pretty much the OP weapon of the game. See, so once you upgrade it past level 1, see those little uh, dots flying off it? Those are like homing missiles, and they do a lot of damage. So yeah, never mind. I got my flamethrower. That's pretty much the end of the level. I win. Game over. I don't know if it's harder. I'm playing on easy as well, because again, like I said, yeah. I think I already said that. But anyway, easy peasy. Look at this. I just gotta. Every time you tap, it releases some. So you can hold the button and just throw a flamethrower. Not exciting, but then you do just tap it, just tap it a little bit, tap it over and over again, and it just unleashes these awesome deadly little missiles, or f flares, or whatever they are. I'm not really sure. Hey, better minigun. Pew, 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 pew. Break all this. Yeah, rocket guys, you jerks. Okay, so, let's see how much I can kill and if I can not die. Ooh, I'm getting hit a lot. And this thing, go and blow that up. That was easy. Over here. Blow that up. That was easy. Uh, yeah, I actually beat this game my first night I played it. Not my, uh, not to beat the entire thing, just the, the storyline. Got all but two achievements that same night. It, it was a, this game is really easy, and then I quickly got the other two this morning. Boom, 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 boom. Heck, when I my first run through the game, I died a total of one time, at all, like one time. That's this game is really easy. I'm not sure why the ra the ratio on true achievements is so high. It's like three something for the final achievement, which makes no sense whatsoever. Easy, easy, easy. Just gotta fly around, dodge this. I used to be scared of these kind of games, but I've done like Voltron and Warhammer and God, what was the other one I just did recently? Sky Force Anniversary. They were a little tougher than these kind of games, so I'm not too worried anymore. I'm a little more confident in playing this kind of stuff. Pew, 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 pew. Just constantly fire these things out. If anything kind of comes on screen, they're dead. Oh, these things are pretty much crates. Grab that. Ooh, flat cannon upgrade. Pew! Pew boom, pew boom. Pew boom. Pew boom. Ooh, nuke. I'll take that. Okay, so switch back. Burn it all. Nothing will escape my wrath. Not really sure what the storyline behind this game is. Something about androids or cyborgs or something. I don't know. But I'm the last something. Last human, maybe? I'm not really sure. Oh, almost missed that guy. I want to kill everything. Kill everything. Let's see if I can not lose my car once. I'm going to try it. It's going to be pretty rough though. It's pretty easy to get damaged just enough by some missile or something you didn't see. I'm not going to go to the underground areas because those are annoying. I already got that achievement. So the final achievement, the hard one, quote unquote, is to beat all those underground zones marked by that little symbol right there, a little teleporter. And uh, you have to do it all in one run of the game without dying. And now when you go down there, you're outside your car. So you, you're like a little fleshy meat bag that can die real easy. And boy, will you. Oh, someone finally got away. I missed one. Boom, 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 boom. Look at all this it's death everywhere. Oh, nice little cruise in the ocean. I don't know where I am in the ocean. Area 5. No, I'm in Area 7, I think, at this point. Yeah, good old beautiful Area 7. Nice little vacation spot for you and the kids. Okay, so here I'm going to miss some, because I'm going to just murder everything. Let's go ahead and murder that guy. 
boom, one down, go here, for this guy. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Ow, 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 ow. Those, it's getting a little hectic. Oh, I might lose my car. It's getting close. I think I'm gonna survive it. I think I'm gonna survive it. Okay. Whew! That was close. Come this way. Ooh, treasure chests. We got... I don't know what I picked up. What's in here? Ooh, flat cannon upgrade. I'm gonna pass. Yeah, I'm gonna pass. Flamethrower, uh, if I can get a flamethrower upgrade, that'd be great. So flamethrower is just, it, at level 3, it's just ridiculous how strong it is. Bosses, everything falls. Oh, and there it is. Game over. This level's done. Flamethrower upgrade! It's over. That's it. Blue fire. It's like Super Saiyan Blue, man. It's done. Boss fight. Hope you don't have crabs, because this is going to trigger you. Blast that thing. Boom, dead. Oh no, now it's really angry. Let's go ahead and destroy as much as I can here. Oh, I might lose my car. I might just need one more just tap and I'm done. Let's go ahead and come over here. That's dead. Let's go ahead and destroy this. Look at that. I mean, look how strong this thing is. Again, it's because I'm playing on easy, I get it, but still, dang. I'm playing a challenge. It really is controlling the camera. I never really noticed that. I thought maybe I was just, this is the way I just kept going. Clockwise seems like what a rational human being would do. Okay, well, yep, this thing's getting torn apart. Pew, 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 pew. Some of the achievements are glitchy. That can be a little bit of a problem. Like the accuracy one, I couldn't figure out. Because it doesn't count this as accuracy, only bullets. And I would shoot a couple bullets at like an enemy, kill them, and then go through the level using the flamethrower and still come out with like a 56%. I made no sense. But I ended up figuring it out. I actually don't know how I figured it out or what I did, but I, I got it to work at least. So That's all I care about. I only got my achievement. Pew. Go ahead and blow this up quick. Yeah, because that'll, that'll break my... I almost never don't lose my uh, thing here. I almost always lose my my car on this part. Oh, usually it's... I've never seen him shoot that before. Usually he slams at me. And that hurts. Like, it, again, it's instant kill for my car, so... One down. Oh. Ooh, look at that. I think I'm actually going to beat him. Boom! Oh, beat the entire level. Flawless victory. Zone complete. Well, that was easy. It was a nine minute freaking video. I have to put, a, I put on a goddamn workshop, though. That's how you do it, right there. 45% accuracy, like a boss. 273,925 points. And as you can see, once it loads up, slowly but surely. Don't call me Shirley. There it is. Salty arrows. And as you can see, yeah, I got all the achievements. Got these today. I'm gonna go date this at 513 is when I recorded this. And all these on 512. Took me barely two days. Easy peasy. I'm working on this now. I got all these. Cool. That is a Salty Heroes. Old XBLA game. It's still on the it's still on the marketplace. It hasn't been delisted or anything. Uh, it's not backwards compatible, so don't bother. Yeah, that's uh, Soul Heroes. There's a sequel. Play it. Play this one. Play neither. I don't really care. But thanks for watching. Uh, have a nice day. Peace.